Weather Authority Local Weather Forecast. Welcome back. A cloudy day for us here on this Wednesday, and we're still going to be experiencing this thick layer of clouds. So as we look on our satellite and radar, you can just see those clouds moving through from the west, but there is that wet weather staying further up toward the north, but we're expected to stay pretty dry. So how dry are we talking? Look at our dew points. We are going to be still seeing those dew points hanging out in the 30s, even 40s, so pretty comfortable conditions, and this is pretty much how we can expect the rest of this week going to continue to be. Um, we do have this specific storm that is going to be bringing in that moisture, but mainly not for us. It will be staying further up toward the north, but for us here in the desert southwest, we'll get a little bit of that moisture later on going into the weekend actually, but even then we're expected to have pretty light and very small chances where we can even experience more rain, so not like we did on Friday, but still something I'll be looking out for. We'll still be cloudy at times, so that Pacific storm will be bringing in the clouds here and there. Occasionally we will see some sunlight here, but we are going to just see passing clouds continuing even going into the weekend. We'll have times where we'll be mostly cloudy for our New Year's, but again, we're going to be staying pretty dry conditions for our region. Um, again, slight little moisture will start to trickle its way back in on Saturday, but even then we're still looking fairly dry for us, so we could pretty much enjoy our New Year's, which will be pretty great. But we do have an air quality alert that is still in effect. It does include Imperial Nel Centro and it's due to a no burn day. So do not do any um, uh, fire burning activities as of right now. So that will expire at midnight Pacific Standard Time. Now the rest of the desert southwest is not including with those colder conditions. You'll definitely want to be um, snuggled up and try to find ways to be warm because our temperatures are going to be cooling down even more. But quickly now looking on our air quality index sponsored by Imperial County Air Pollution Control District. It is looking not too bad. We do have moderate for Calexico and El Centro, but that is also where that air quality alert is currently sitting at while everywhere else is looking pretty good. And like I was talking about those temperatures, well, look at that. We are going to be a pretty cold start to our Thursday, so we're going to see temperatures dipping down into the 40s, and we'll even see some 30s out there, but pretty average for this time of year. We are in the winter season, so we can expect these colder conditions. And speaking of colds, well, you got to make sure we are preparing for the cold. Make sure you're, you're looking out for your four P's, your pets, people, plants, and pipes. Make sure you're checking on those um, consistently throughout the season to make sure everything is looking okay because our temperatures will continue to get a little bit cooler as the days go on through the months. And quickly now on our eight-day forecast, our temperatures are going to be pretty close to seasonable, nothing too concerning. We are going to have um, those clouds, like I said, we're going to be lingering in. Some days will be a little bit cloudier than others, but for the most part, we're going to start off our New Year's pretty dry and comfortable conditions, and overnight lows will still be on the even chillier side, but overall, not too bad.